to my channel and if you're new what's up my name is Pam and this is my beauty space for today's video I'm going to be reviewing slash having a first impression on the Kylie eye of the storm palette and this is what it looks like it's a lot smaller than I thought it would be when I ordered it but whatever Okay, so this palette inside looks like this. And it didn't come in one of those little plastic flimsy things that palettes usually come with. And honestly, the way it's made, I already see so many issues with it. Like the yellow looks like it was like gouged with your nail. And a couple of the pans are lifted. But we're still going to do a look with this nonetheless. Um, so not only do I own this little palette here. I'm also doing a giveaway on the Eye of the Storm palette. So uh, I'll let you know everything you have to do at the end of the video. And yeah, it'll be my first YouTube uh, giveaway, I guess you can say. Hmm. So I already have my foundation on. I contoured. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and do my eyebrows. I didn't do them. So I'm using the Maybelline Total Temptation Medium Brow Brow Definer. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and prime uh, with the same primer I always use. This is MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pop. And so I got my nails done right now. I'm just going to take a brush and just dip right in there. My nails are super orange. I wanted to make sure and have um, some sort of like, you know, like a bright color because we went to Jamaica. So I kind of wanted to... I like a fun tropical color. It's so cold here in New York. Like, there's going to be another snowstorm tomorrow. Like, it's not fair. I'm just going to go ahead and swatch each one of these, and then I'll figure out what color I want to have. So let's start from the very top color. Um, oh, they do have names. But I wonder... Okay, so let's start from the this color on the side this is sweet storm swatch that it looks <laughs> take out my hairy ass arm for you guys so sweet storm looks like this it's kind of like a metallic uh goldy kind of color. Thunderstruck. It's like a purple. It's like a lilac. Lilac-y purple. That looks like that. That beautiful yellow that I see everyone using. It's called Light Year. It's kind of chalky. But it is pigmented. But kind of chalky. Next one is... Thunderstruck, which is this purpley color. It's pretty. It has like glitter on it. I don't feel like any of the colors are super, super pigmented. Like if you want to talk about a Juvia's Place palette or you know what I mean? It's not on that kind of level. This is that very silver color and that's called Electric. And that is Dreamcatcher. Wait, yeah, Dreamcatcher. It's like a nude kind of color. So it's a nice little bra bone color. And that looks like that. Whirlwind. Isn't it crazy like that these palettes retail for $40 and they don't even come with a mirror? It's kind of fucked up. And I kind of have to dig in there for this color. 
and it looks like this. Honestly, I thought that one would be a lot more pigmented than it is. That sucks. Um, next, it is Cyclone. And it's the green, emerald green kind of color. I don't know, it looks more forest green on camera, but it's definitely more of an emerald green in person. And that looks like this. That's super pigmented. So pretty. Next, you have Set of Steel. And it is kind of like a it's like a brown, dark brown with like a purple undertone. That's how I can describe it. Or maybe I'm colorblind, but it looks brown, purpley kind of to me. I'll put that over here. It's kind of chalky. It's kind of chalky. Yeah, Stargaze. And that is this nice like black with like silver glitter in it. And that looks like that. So these are all the colors. Like I want to create the whole look just using this. Um, I'm gonna go in with like yeah, fluffy brush. And I'm picking up the Delium Tool Seven Seven Six brush, and I'm gonna go in with that color. I'm gonna go in with the color Thunderstruck. So I'm just building up that color right into my crease in a windshield wiper motion. How much do you hate when people tell you that? So I'm gonna pick up Dream Catcher and that's the color I'm gonna to use to blend out the ends and kinda of on the on the brow bone. color has a lot of fallout. Ooh, I'm definitely gonna have to grab some powder and just put that right under my eyes. There. How cute do I look? I'm gonna pick up Urban Decay Flat Shader Brush and I'm just gonna go ahead and go in. There's so much fallout on this color. Oh my god. It's like one of those colors you don't really need to do much to. Because there's a lot. It's a lot. Okay. Mucho. I'm just going to pick up another brush. And because I feel like it needs a little bit of intensity, I'm going to go in with that black. Or. <laughs> stargaze and I'm just gonna go in right here oh that has a lot of fallouts so much fallout just like to give her that kind of smoky kind of look it looks pretty intense you can pick up a blending brush and blend it up and blend that sucker out. There's literally so much, so much fallout from this palette. Everywhere. And when I mean everywhere, everywhere. All right, I'm gonna pick up just any flat shader brush and I'm gonna go in to Sweet Storm and I'm putting that in my tear duct. It's so pigmented. It's really pretty. I'm picking up the Delium Tool 714 brush and I'm just gonna spray that with some Fix Plus. And I'm just gonna go ahead and go into the, that yellow. I'm just going to do like a line on my bottom waterline. It's 
So I'm just using the NYX Matte Liquid Liner. The same eyeliner I always use. So my face still looks crazy because like all of the eyeshadows like all over it. So I guess I'm gonna have to fix my foundation. But um, I decided I'm gonna pick up some eyeliner and like do like a front wig, wing, a front wig, as well as an outer wing. So in order to do that, you just kind of you grab the liner from the top. And instead of, you don't want the wing to go down, you kind of want it to go straight. Like that. Okay, so I'm picking up my Maybelline eyeliner. I'm going to tight line my eyes though. Okay, so I'm going to be using, <clears throat> for lashes, the Mykonos from the Lily Lashes Sephora collection. And this is actually made with um, wax hair. These are actually fake. So this is my first time using these. They're actually a lot cheaper. Um, I think they were 9 bucks, and I pay like, I think $29 for my Mykonos lashes. Huda Beauty. Venus liquid matte lipstick. Oh, this is pretty. So on top of this, I'm gonna go ahead and put MAC Lust Lip Glass. Um, so I decided to just put my hair out. I clipped in a few extensions and curled all of it together and that's about it um so all I have left is my highlight and I'm gonna use my new baby the Anastasia and Amrezy highlight look at this it's like it's fake look, this is literally everything so I'm just gonna pick up a brush lately I've been using this little guy and I'm just gonna highlight So this is my finished look. I kind of went from wanting to do natural to like, bam. But anyway, I hope you guys like it. So now these are the rules to enter the giveaway for the Eye of Storm palette by Kylie Cosmetics. Um, all you have to do is follow me on my Instagram. And my Instagram is at underscore just pan underscore J-U-S-T-P-A-M on Instagram and just follow me on here. Also, make sure you comment after you're done if you don't follow me already and just let me know what do you love about makeup? Why do you love makeup? I think that's pretty easy. Follow me on Instagram, follow me on YouTube and let me know why you like makeup. That's it. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and yeah, I'm going to go wash this shit off and go to bed, because I got to be up at like 7 for work tomorrow. Thank you for watching, and yeah, love you guys. Bye.